Hungry children in America, an obesity epidemic, an agricultural economy that drives farmers out of business, lost soil, and contaminated water. Our food system, the basis for our health, our culture, and our economy, is broken. How do we make sense out of all of this? Who has solutions for fixing this mess? The Food and Society Fellows do. These are innovative professionals from all over the country who all agree on one thing. Healthy food and sustainable agriculture provide the foundation for healthy people, thriving farms, and a vibrant economy. I pass so many places around this country that have these huge lots that are sitting empty. Whether they're schools, faith communities, hospitals, they should get on board and be a part of this movement. The stakes are high. And what scares Big Ag and Big Meat the most is that more and more of us are learning that the way they're producing our food is destroying the planet. We put up this uh, request to the next president of the United States that um, he or she, we didn't know who it would be at the time, uh, replant a garden at the White House, that that garden go to feed the first family, and that there be overflow for a local food pantry. And who are these fellows? They are farmers, gardeners, public health professionals, community organizers, journalists, dietitians, chefs, historians, policy advocates, theologians, physicians, writers, and filmmakers. Started in 2001 by the Kellogg Foundation and directed by the Institute for Agriculture and Trade Policy, the Food and Society Fellows Program provides a stipend, training, and other support for innovative change makers working independently and collaboratively towards a sustainable food system. When I started the fellowship, I had this notion about uh, the relationship between uh, food and health. If, if indeed our, our world is one that is one large organism that, uh, around which coexistence is important, and I believe it is, I understand more parts of it than I did before I started the fellowship. I think that having a community of people who are knowledgeable, and who are passionate about what they're doing and who truly believe that they can change the world helps you want to be a better person. The, the fellowship has impacted me in that um, since most of, of what I do for it is either like when I come to Washington I you know, meet with politicians, but I write a lot and when you're farming in the summer and the spring and the fall, it's a pretty full-time job, so I spend a lot of late night hours writing. So it's, it's meant my days are longer. But it's, it's connected me with a lot of people too. For me, the Food and Society Fellowship has been uh, a license to, to do what I've always wanted to do, to, to take the projects that uh, I, I wasn't able to, to fund elsewhere, to take the ideas that were, uh, that were sort of growing inside my head and, and give them voice. The list of successes is long with projects that help change the way we think about policy, the way we think about schools and education, and the way we think about growing and distributing food. Fellows are leading authors, filmmakers, and speakers, as well as creative users of new media. What Parent Earth is gonna do is it's not just gonna give you information to help you make you know, the right choices for your kids in terms of food, but we're also gonna bring parents together as a force to be reckoned with so that we can change policy and we can improve corporate behavior and we can make a better world for our kids to grow up in. So Farm to School, it's bringing local farmers' products into the school system. But it's much more than just local sustainable procurement. It's actually incorporating nutrition education into the classroom, it's taste tests, it's farm field trips, it's, it's the farm tours, it's having the CSA, which is Community Supported Agriculture in the classroom. We must support water as a universal human right. And so I say that the world is really counting on you um, to, to make these small changes that lead to huge, huge um, impacts in the world. We can make amazing changes, but we need help. It takes everyone. It takes the superintendent and the school board. It takes parents. It takes advocates. It takes the whole community. If we want to solve this problem, we all have to just do our part to make a difference for all kids in America. Visit foodandsocietyfellows.org to find out more on how Food and Society Fellows are creating new ways of thinking, growing, and eating food for everyone.